Helena Bonham Carter was hired by Fight Club despite the fact that she was too young because of her talented sex scenes. Brad Pitt deserves a lot of credit for Helena Bonham Carter's performance in Fight Club. She might not have attracted David Fincher's notice at all if it weren't for Pitt alerting him to her performances. Pitt's influence was crucial in putting Bonham Carter in the public eye with the classic movie. Helena Bonham Carter played Marla Singer, the love interest of Ed Norton's character in David Fincher's cult favorite in a stunning performance. She wasn't the director's first choice, which surprised me. Before Carter finally landed the iconic part, Fincher was bombarded with names like Courtney Love and Reese Witherspoon. However, Courtney Love had a sexual relationship with Edward Norton, who played Brad Pitt's co-star in the movie during that time. David Fincher was persuaded by this circumstance to think that having love in the film may provide difficulties and difficulties. In addition, Fincher wanted to consider other options for the role of Marla because he thought love could have been too apparent a choice. Reese Witherspoon was ultimately rejected by Fincher as a candidate for the role of Marla, primarily because of worries that her age didn't fit the intended tone of the film. The subject of casting for the part was discussed while a visitor was at Brad Pitt's home. Brad persuaded David Fincher to see a particular sequence from the film The Wings of the Dove, in which Helena Bonham Carter shows extreme melancholy during an intense sex scene. She gave a powerful performance, and Fincher was greatly moved by her. Helena Bonham Carter met with David Fincher in person to discuss the part. She expressed interest, but she also had some misgivings. The intriguing aspect to Bonham Carter's decision-making process about Fight Club was added by Fincher's speculation that her mother might have had an impact on her ambivalence. Bonham Carter admitted that she first had her misgivings about the project because her mother thought the writing was a pollutant and didn't like it. She, too, was confused by the script's message and doubted its ability to improve lives. Her viewpoint on the script, however, changed after speaking with Fincher, leading her to reconsider her choice.